<laughs> oh my god. Here we go. <laughs> Today's the day. Good morning, everyone. It is April 22nd, 2021. It is Thursday morning, like I said, and today's the day that I have been waiting for essentially since the beginning of this year. I just got out of the shower, I just put my laundry in, and I'm about to go just make myself some breakfast and then clean the rest of my place because as you can tell, all my luggage and everything is still there and I feel like I want to come back to a clean house. And that leads us into the present day today and I'm really excited. Like I said before, I've never been to Chicago before so I'm just really hoping that my first time there will be a memorable experience. And I think they're almost here to pick me up and I still have a few more things to pack so yeah. Okay, so we have a bit of a drive to Austin, but first, what hey, up? Oh <laughs> What's up? Okay, so we just had to drop off the dog. While they're doing that, I'm just gonna be explaining what's gonna be happening. So after here, we are gonna be going from here to Austin because we live in San Antonio right now, but the flights out from Austin are a lot cheaper than they are out of San Antonio for some reason, and I'm really excited. First, we are going to didn't know this was the largest gas station in America so this is pretty awesome that it's here and it's just a sort of drive from San Antonio up to Austin. Okay, so we just made it at the airport and this is my first time and I think it's their first time as well going into uh, Austin Airport. So this will be an experience for all of us. So I just checked in my bags and there is a lot less people in this airport than I thought there would be which is a good thing because of COVID and everything. It's just super weird. Last time I was at like an airport and lines used to be all kinds of packed but now there's just basically nothing. There's basically no one and all my friends are still checking in their bags so we'll see how long this lasts. We just got done with the TSA pre-check stuff and it wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Did you think it was as bad? It wasn't terrible. Okay, yeah. It could have been worse. Yeah, that's true. So now we are just using the bathroom and then we are gonna go to this lounge thing where hopefully we can get into. I don't know what it, hopefully. it's called hopefully since we're in the military, but we'll see how that goes. So. <laughs> okay, so since we're here, I'm just gonna show you guys around. They have that, they have all those things. They have a lot of desserts, which I might get some. And they have a bunch of other stuff too. They have some fruit just in case. And they have some pita chips. And then here is the bar area. If you guys want to take any um, drinks or anything, restrooms. And there's a view of the airport down there, which this is actually really cool and I'm surprised because I don't think I've ever been in a class lounge before. You know, perks of being in the military, I guess. Hey, we're, we're going on a trip.
go. Hey, we're gonna check out. Hey. Go. <laughs> We are going to be getting our Uber to the city to go to our hotel, but the traffic is apparently really bad. It's going to be an hour in traffic from here to the airport, so I'm not really excited about that. But guess what? We're in Chicago, and it's really nice so far. I mean, it's not as crowded. Apparently, it's more crowded than when they went in November, but... Yeah, it's nice. I mean, our baggage was super fast. We didn't have to wait for it, but then again, we used the bathroom beforehand because we're gonna be sitting in traffic. So, let's go. Well, one thing they were right about is that it is very windy. At least it's nice out. Are you on the 14th? Yeah, 14th floor, 8. So, right next I think so. Uh, okay, here's my room for the night. And oh my gosh, we are on the 14th floor and I am not ready, but you know what? Here we go. I'm gonna bring in my stuff and then I'm gonna show you guys around but like bro yo yo this is so crazy I don't I just don't have one window area I have two and this is surreal. Oh my god. I wanted a good view, but I did not expect this at all. Okay, I'm just gonna get settled and then I'll show you guys around in a bit. So, yeah. Okay, so I have settled in and I'm ready to show you guys my room. So, come on in. Let's, let me give you the tour of the place, which is not much, you know. And here's the first thing that you see, which is basically this desk area, which is pretty awesome you know I feel what I need to do I feel like it's a very nice place and I think I am gonna be editing a video tonight so stay tuned for that yeah but the next thing we have is this couch right here and I feel like I think this actually opens up into another bed but I am not gonna need it since I'm the only one in this room but I'm pretty happy with that you know there's the mirror so I can you know look good and feel good and decide what I'm gonna be wearing for the entire days that I'm here. And this place also has a closet so I can put and hang all my clothes that I have in my luggage after I'm done unpacking. Three drawers just in case I need it, but I don't think I'm gonna be using the drawers that much because I don't know how clean they are. I also have a fridge and I'm not sure if I'm going to be using this a lot, probably just for like water and stuff, but you know, it's a pretty decent sized fridge. And now let me give you a tour of the bathroom, which you know, there's not much to it, you know, there is a toilet, there's this nice walk-in shower head, which I'm really excited about, there's some towels, and there's me, how you doing? And yeah, this place is just really great and of course the final thing is the bed and I don't know I just feel like I'm super I don't know I'm just like so happy right now like I am literally just so happy to be in Chicago I just can't believe it when I was like driving in when we were driving in from that uber I just could not believe I could not stop looking at it like it's so much bigger than any city that I've been to honestly I think the last time I've seen something like this is in San Francisco but even then it was just absolutely crazy 
Oh yeah, and I can't forget the best part of this room, and that is the view. Like, look at that view. Like, look at how tall those sky skyscrapers are. Like, you can't tell on camera, but they are honestly so huge. I also have a view of this street, and then if you go, if you like, look down the street, I think there's actual Chicago River, which I'm at. That's so crazy that I get to be here and. Like, it's not, again, it's not just this wall, it is that wall as well. I mean, there's not much to see on this wall. I can still see downtown, which is pretty great. Um, the only downside is that there's a bunch of office buildings, like, right there. And basically, people can probably see me down there as well. And there's more offices over here. So, I can't just walk around naked. I have to actually, like, put down these blinds just so I can, you know, have some privacy while I'm here. But overall, it's just absolutely crazy. <sighs> but yeah, that is pretty much my room and I am in Chicago. Like I, my first impressions when I came here were just like, wow. Like I did not expect it. The last city that I was really in that impressed me this much was San Francisco. And that's why I loved it so much. It was just so big, so grand, so unique. The architecture, and that's basically the same as this place. Like honestly, all the architecture, all the buildings, like I, I never, I didn't realize how much I miss seeing like tall buildings until I came here because of course there's downtown San Antonio, but that doesn't really have any big buildings as well at least not as much as this city and I absolutely love it so much. I am so happy. I can't wait to explore this city and I'm so thankful that I actually got a room with a decent view because I think Yolanda and Kevin have a room as well down the hall but theirs is facing the building that's right next to us which I was very feel fearful for when I was booking um, this place so I was not excited for that. But I am excited just to see what else the city has to offer. I don't think we're going to be doing anything else that important today. I think we're just going to be going to get some deep dish pizza. And then probably just retiring early for the night. But tonight I have to record my reaction to the Save Your Tears remix featuring Ariana Grande from the weekend. And I'm really excited just to do it here because that's probably the first time that I'm actually going to react to something from... A place that's not my place so I'm really excited for that and I think we're gonna be leaving in a bit so yeah I'll talk to you guys more whenever that is so okay so it's pizza time so let's get Yolanda and Kevin but first let's see what their room looks like as compared to mine where's their room is this it is it them I think it's them I hope it's them it would be really awkward if it wasn't let me see y'all's view. Oh, y'all look so pretty. Oh my god. Let me see the let me see the view of your amazing apartment. <laughs> You're amazing. Wow, I love the view of the your view of the building. It's so pretty. Like it's a nice. It's pretty much the same as my place. But you guys can definitely like look at it before we leave too. I have I, I left my wallet in there anyways. But I want to get y'all's reaction to my room. So <laughs> here we go. What the? Wow. Oh my god! Yo, I have no idea. I think it's because when I s like look at the view. Now you can see the river from there. Oh my god! It's literally. How? It's crazy. Look at the tower. I know. Oh is that? I don't know. God. That's crazy. Oh so on a scale of one to ten, how jealous are you guys? Of? Really jealous. Yeah. Is not fair. Yeah. Honestly, you guys should get it. No. 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 Appetizer time! Wow. Bon appetit! <laughs> Yay! First meal here. Oh. Mm. This is really good. I can only imagine what the pizza tastes like. Oh, that's a lot. Oh my 
God. That's a big one. Oh, oh Okay, it's my first Your bite first of deep dish pizza. I'm like six bites in. But... Here we go. <laughs> Heavenly or they so cheesy, I love it. Wow. I like the crust. That's just stuff in your faces. <laughs> I know. I know. We can do it. Willis Tower. Let's think of our trip here. Very exciting. Okay, for sure. It was like a full day. Yeah. Before tomorrow. So, yeah. Okay, well, I'll see you guys. See Bye. You guys tomorrow. Okay. <sighs> okay, so we just got done with our first half day in Chicago. Our first full day won't start until tomorrow morning but i am just really excited i mean like in all honesty i feel like today went really smoothly um in regards to like the flights and the check-ins and the lounges and just flying in general like it was just overall a pretty smooth experience even getting here with like the uber ride the guy was super nice and just the city and the pizza it's 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 been a great start to chicago and hopefully tomorrow for our first full day we can definitely do a lot um and not get tired so that's why i'm going to be going to sleep in a bit again i'm going to have to react to the remix of save your tears uh by ariana grande and the weekend so if you guys haven't already checked that out check that out and yeah i guess for now i'll just chillax or take a nap or something and yeah, it was a great full day, so I'm really excited just to see what else is in store for all of us. And with that, welcome to Chicago. And until the next video, the wonder will stop. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. Woo! Oh, after hours and hours of waiting, and editing and reacting to the Save Your Tears remix. Finally going to sleep. <laughs> then I'm going to be waking up at 6. Hopefully I have energy tomorrow. Ugh.